All right, what's up, guys? Taken King and 2.0 came out. A lot of big changes, a lot of minor changes, but most of all, it was a big change. And let's talk about Crucible, because a lot of people still play it. It's still fun. I still play it, so I'm pretty sure there's a hefty amount of you that played it more than PVE. So right now, the most popular game mode in Crucible is Rip. No doubt about it, hands down most popular game mode maybe because it's new or maybe because it's team oriented instead of you know going around killing people getting supers going around killing people not doing objectives stuff like that some people are bad at rift some people are good and some are eh, meh. so i'm here to tell you guys a good bit of tips and tricks to get you whooping the other team like slapping slaughter fest whooping that's what i mean Okay, first tip guys, this one's an easy tip, you can just do it like pretty much every time and you could probably win a lot more if you did this tip. So play with a friend or a group of friends. Simple guys, play with a group of friends. In this game, communication is key, without a doubt, key. And if you don't have any communication in your team, you're just a bunch of fish, fish doing your own thing. Like, you're just swimming around, you're going your own way, you're going your own path, you're doing your own thing. So, it doesn't matter if they're bad. Go get a group of friends. Or a friend. Doesn't matter, guys. It will make the experience much more enjoyable. And chances are you probably win a lot more. So, there's that. Now, sometimes, your friends might be busy, or they're offline, or they have to go somewhere, or blah blah blah, or they might have an excuse not to play with you. In my case, that's what happened. So, I mean, that's fine too, but it, it just it just makes the it just makes the game mode a little more a little bit more difficult. If you're like me and you just like want to pick up the spark constantly and you don't trust your teammates, well then hear this next tip out. Drill this next tip in your head, because this will help you a lot. So, what you want to do is picking up the spark. If you have, if you have a team that's like, you know, you have full control of the entire game so far, and there's like five or six people huddling around the spark, make sure you're right dead center in that spark. Like it's a toilet, and you need to go poo poo really fast. Make sure you're dead center. And before that counter comes down, before this, the Rift like starts charging again, right before like two seconds, just hold that X button. Like, I mean tape that X button down. The second the uh, spark starts to charge up, you will already start to grab it. Like, the loading screen will instantly start up. And chances are, you'll probably grab the spark like more times than usual. And that's what I do, and I grab the spark like 80% of the times, guys, so... Yeah, that's a really good tip. And when you run with a spark, spark, I just recommend having blink because closing a distance of one or two meters instantly can be so useful as opposed to like gliding that distance and giving your enemy an extra second or two to kill you. Like there's some guns that can probably kill you faster than one second. Like bad juju, if they land all three shots, you're probably dead in like 0.9 seconds or something. I don't know the actual calculations because, I mean, I don't have time for that. So, that is super important. Having blink. Having blink. I don't know, man. They just, it doesn't feel like they nerfed blink enough. I mean, it feels, it feels like blink hasn't been nerfed at all, actually. So, I mean, blink, blink is just so 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 hard to counteract like what way would there be to nerf blink right like what are you gonna do make make the distance shorter but that's just gonna make people not use blink at all so you gotta like perfectly nerf it and that's really hard well anyway i've been ranting ranting about blink tip number three if you don't get the spark it's okay it's not the end of the world don't let your salt go above normal it's a team game, guys. Remember that. Just escort your teammate to the side. Side! Keyword, side. Don't let him run through the middle. Like, the middle is where everyone spawns at. 
if you run through the middle and like five people spawn like ahead of you, you're gonna die. There's no question about that. Just pretend like he's a blind man and you're the instructor. Start shooting him if he goes the wrong way. And if he does it, then you're out of luck. Just follow him. Be his meat shield, clear the way, pop supers, do whatever you can, and make sure he dunks that. I was about to say ball. Just make <laughs> balls. Make sure he just dunks that, uh, what, what is this called? Rift. Just make sure he dunks the thing into the rift. Yeah. And, uh, you won't win. Just getting one dunk can get you like 4,000 points. That's ridiculous. Make sure you get those dunks. Well, that's what I got for you guys. So, see you later. Peace!